Spirit, the youngest team in the tournament, as Yuri will just find one with the duelies. And Patsy opening up that A bomb site is looking for more. And indeed, it will be, well, Dexter to find the third kill for his team as K Serrara tries his best to bring this one back for his team. He's gone down though, can't bring it back. Chopper will put an end to his life. And how safe. The newest recruit to the team, left alive, known for his orping, not necessarily his pistol work. And Chopper will cut him down to size and get Spirit off to a 1-0. 250 work, though, from the Shadow. And in doing so, though, Spirit have forced away enough eyes from the A side where it has become a very clear and free plant. Now, they could just hold on to this for mass. Wouldn't be a, sh a terrible or shabby outcome, especially considering they haven't fully invested behind the rest of the players. Mm -hmm. Plus, a Mac 10 is not too shabby as well, but Dexter seems to have a good read of the situation. He's already moving down onto ramp. He could do without losing this AK, though. It's the only AK they actually possess. The rest of the players have Galils. Yeah, I don't see. I don't really envision Dexter going for this. Absolutely not worth losing that AK-47, especially when you know your 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 opponent just went for the force buy. It's a it's a very typical buy from Furia, you know. You, you sometimes usually you see only Art going for like the hero buy, while everyone else, even though they might completely destroy the the buy heading to the next round, it's something that we are more than used to seeing from Furia quite frequently. So I'm not surprised at all. And here we go. We will finally see. The buy coming in still won't be great, however. Yuri's got that Mac. Already taking some outside control. Wall of smoke, Smoke's now being deployed. But Art on the close angle's been flashed, and more importantly, he's been finished off by Patsy, who tries to go in strength for strength. A bit of damage done to Serato, but he's doubled up. And this is always the problem against Furia. One player, they have so much ability, whether it's Serato, whether it's Yuri, whether it's safe, it doesn't matter. The end result is the same, and that's the Brazilians winning out. Yuri, just like a jack-in-the-box, just popping out with the FAMAS, catching the two remaining players off guard. Bro, <laughs> that's no joke. That's why you watch uh, Nat Geo, man. Like, sometimes you find these crazy things. It's like this Jaguar looking into the water, and I'm like, what's he looking at? And jumps in and drags out a crocodile, and I'm like, okay, all right, cool. No joke, man. One of the strongest bites in, uh, in the United Kingdom. So right now, Fury up. Making it very, very clean indeed. It was just uh, the eco from Spirit. No Impact in the last round from Heaven. He could maybe sneak back up there again. It's going to take a little bit of time. Main is smoked off. This is trying to sell a false narrative to Furia. We smoked Main off. Why would anyone be in this position? But Chopper's about to show his hand. No one comes through hot. This is going to make this a more one-dimensional push. And considering that Euro, Yuri, I should say, and K Serato are so here, they can just spray you down. And that's exactly what they've done. It looked so easy for the two of them. Yeah, it's so hard to crack open to the bomb side, especially 20 seconds remaining on the clock. Yuri and K Serato. Great angle there from Yuri. The bit of the the Zero. Zero. Yeah. yeah, against a full buy. That was just absolutely good. His drop playing a very aggressive game here against the pistols, but he does of course have the contingency that is safe with the AWP. Right close by. Looking to farm a little bit of cash. He's kind of low in health, so he's going to fall back, reload, and as they come charging and looking for the hunt, safe stare. A little cheeky little collateral. Why there not? We go. I mean, it was a done deal, right? It's full on eco. That's why we're kind of just bypass. They are peeling back, Vince. Grouping back towards the lobby area. 48 seconds. Art wants that same position, but this time, Magix is going to come out on top. There's the impact we were looking for, but can they do anything behind this? The bomb has been dropped down by Yuri, but Serato has met his demise. And Magix has doubled up. Yuri, big frags, 13 on the board already for the superstar, Brazilian. But the numbers are dry, they're thin. Time itself, though, is ticking away, and there is a flank coming into fruition. Safe is surely going to be unable to clutch this round. The bomb's been spilled, 18 seconds to go. And now he can look as the player drops down. He misses his shot, but 15 seconds. Spirit have to push into his crosshair. You have to feel, and Patsy's going to do just that. And that will be Spirit getting back into this game. Enemy for Spirit. They need to check their angles. They need to get these kills down quickly in case Rado is staying alive. He's keeping himself in amongst the action. The bomb is still down. Art is still alive as well. This has been a complete disaster. Spirit unable to get their hands onto this side. have walked into the trap and the trap is sprung by Kei Serato. There's no time. There's no chance. And they may even die after time if they're not careful, which would be even more brutal. So Dexter has to just get the hell out of there. The Fury have got their sixth round. Kei Serato, man, he's such a thorn. 
and they were unable to pluck him out. 30 seconds to play with. Drop can hear all these footsteps, and they're moving into an MP9. Art's already shown just how good he is with his weapon, and he's nullified the AWP first and foremost. Now they can start to divide the rest of the team. Safe has died outside, however, but he's miles away from the bomb, where Siren is currently positioned. The bomb is spilled out on the window side, so even though Spirit did get a little bit of success in terms of frags, it will not be enough to yield the round. They, at least they're able to save the AWP again, but that means Siren won't have the bonus money. It's going to be Nico now. It has to be Nico. Maybe a couple of upgraded pistols coming out. As we enter round number 12. Money. Oh, they're going to go for the force. All right. All right. With the decisions making being made here by Spirit. But look at this, friends. Look at this. The aggression from Ram. The double push. Art going to be joined up with his teammate. He's going to find one. And the second. His teammate's there is for the trade. And Drop and Art have completely, absolutely bodied spirit before they even had any time to get anything done. Dexter trying to find the no scope. Yes, he will indeed, but they will not allow him to save this one, Vince. Safe will find him, and that is Furia switching it up and completely destroying spirit before they could aid to find if you're a spirit. The magic's now slowly inching up. Okay, Serato. He's been playing this position quite often. He's usually in front of the squeaky position, and that could potentially catch him off guard. And there you have it. Magics will fall. Okay, Serato is still looking for ball. Looking for Siren too. Dare to challenge him as Yuri in the meantime takes out Dexter. And this one's done, Vince. Furia, despite a few hiccups here and there, they make it 10 to 5. A solid CD side thus far from the dark horses of not just this, you know, not the favorites just in this game, but one that will win some of these rounds. And some of them were off the back of just pistols. They got a bit fortunate to get downstairs. That being said, though, in the second half, we kick things off with a bang as Dexter oh, at range. Art has the ability to shut this one down. Expect, by the way, if he can get orbs, he's going to have impacts. That's almost guaranteed. It's just whether they give themselves enough room. Meanwhile, though, the aggression comes in, and the HP advantage is starting to go back in favor of Spirit as Chopper lays down the law with the USP. But Yuri is there to claim the first blood in this second half. And Fury, because the bomb's already down to about half of it. Fuse and Siren catches drop. That leaves Yuri in such a tentative position, but he is the top fragger. He has been phenomenal so far. Well placed Smoke has the right idea, but the spray is off. The full 10 second defuse is coming in and try as he may. They safeguard the defuse and Spirit will get their sick. What a huge round from Siren. Like, firstly, Patsy getting two kills in the ramp position with a 5-7. And you and you pointed it out. You said they need a kill immediately. Now, Siren is caught between two angles, though, and he has to go in for the reload. His magazine is depleting. Didn't quite catch. There we go. He has gone in for that reload now. He should be okay. 20 seconds to play with. Bomb still down. Has been picked off before. It's put back down again. And that curse continues. But it was dropped down vents, which is retrievable. Magix now should be able to hold this one by himself. But indeed he will. Had a slow start alongside Dexter. But now the machinery of spirit has been oiled. And it's starting to find its way into this map. And still in with a chance. 30 seconds. 30 seconds on the clock. Siren's still pretty healthy. Judging by Caserado's HP, he's going to have to be the bomb carrier here and just basically sacrifice himself to the CS gods and hope for a trade. And Art may be the man for the job. Smoke down onto Decon. They line up and Siren goes for the reload. They so nearly both fell to his hands, but he comes back in and clutches with just seconds on the clock. What a heads up play from Siren. What a heads up play from Siren. Look at him. Dots pushing downstairs as they are, but Chopper is here with the MP9. And it's not a position that we've really seen Spirit play too much so far. So he could catch safe unawares, as he does. And that's going to drop the bomb down. And considering that the economy behind this is really lackluster, Spirit may not just be in a 14-12 ascendancy. They could have Furia by the scruff of their neck and potentially causing an upset. One more kill to get to 14-12. And as you pointed out there, Vince, yeah, the lost bonus. Furia have a very, very difficult decision to make. You look at the money right there. I saw a few 3,500s. I saw 4,000, a couple of the players. That means they have to decide. Equilibrium will be maintained by Chopper. Balance in all things. As far as Furia concerned, Dexter misses the flick. Doesn't get punished with his life, but he's going to have to deal with the oncoming onslaught of Brazilians. But Dexter and Magix come together when it really counts right in the dying embers. And Spirit have caused an upset. A team that people thought wouldn't even make it through the challenges. And they just bested Furia, one of the favorites in the entire tournament. And it's the youngsters, Vince. It's Patsy and Sun.